The SEC Women's Basketball Tournament starts today, and while players will work hard on the court to fight for a championship, they've already been working in our community. Hey, uh-uh, hold on. Making connections in the classroom and on the court. The SEC's Playmaker Pals program connects SEC athletes with local students. Just the Greenville community and how they've embraced us in our championship, it's, it's more than just showing up for five days here. It's a lasting opportunity for us to leave a legacy. Greenville County schools participate in the partnership. Each school is matched with a different SEC team. Wednesday, students got to meet the athletes they've been communicating with. It was an eye-opening experience for them. Some teams sent pictures and videos. Others wrote letters. Women's basketball players from Missouri took the time to cater to special needs students. It was just amazing how the student athletes took time to actually learn about our students because we are such a special population. Um, they looked at our websites. They looked at our class pages. They our students are nonverbal, so they actually drew pictures instead of just writing letters back to us. So they actually took time to get to know our students. Students that got to spend the day at Bon Secours Wellness Arena and watched the first game of the SEC Women's Basketball Tournament. I want them to see what tremendous role models they have out there that they can aspire to be and be involved in. And whether it's being a, a phenomenal basketball player, the opportunity to go to college, that there's opportunities out there and there's people out there doing it that they can see who have done it. And many of them look like them and come from the same areas that they came from. SEC officials say they'd like to keep the program going here in the upstate. Reporting in Greenville, Paige Hopkins, WIFF News 4.